Good morning guys, before we get into today's vlog, which is a combined vlog, two days in one, I'm going to share with you my updated skincare routine. I love the products that I've been using. So this video is sponsored by Curology, but I love them. I showed them in a recent vlog that wasn't sponsored, like it's just so good. So, so these are my three products. Curology is really awesome for so many different reasons. I'll share a few. The first thing is that you work with a dermatology provider. So this is a custom formula for your skin. You go online, you share your skin concerns, what you want, and then it's actually like a custom formula that's made for you by a Curology provider. It's also nice because if it's not working, you can still talk to that provider over time and then you guys can find something that works for you. Another thing that I think is really helpful is that you just get three products, right? So right here is my skincare routine, which I love because I'm not using like 70 different products. I feel like sometimes that even does more harm than good. I use a cleanser every morning. This is my favorite cleanser ever. And I'm very picky with cleansers and this is my fave. Then the moisturizer, I love this. It's kind of like a gel-based consistency, so it's very cooling on my skin. So I apply this to my face morning and night. And then this, this is the real kicker. This is my cream that I use at night. It's probably my favorite like nighttime skincare product I've ever used. What I love so much about it is, I don't know if you guys can even really see, basically on my skin, any sort of texture issue that I have, it has helped my skin so much with any sort of texture issues. Anyways. We are so close to Christmas, guys. Here we go. It's very gentle on my skin, which I absolutely love. And then my moisturizer. It's great because you work with your dermatology provider. You can talk to them if you need to change things up, if something isn't working. You have access to talking to them, which is really helpful. Listen to this. Merry Christmas. The best part about this, so the first month is free. All you do is pay for shipping and handling, which is $4.95. It's also great because it just arrives right at your door. I just love it so much. So you guys can click the link down below. So again, that's the first month free and you only pay for shipping and handling, which is $4.95. I love Curology. So again, click the link below. Thank you to Curology for sponsoring today's video and let's get into the video. Hi guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 20. I know that I say it in every vlog and I'm sure this is like a tweet making fun of people who do Vlogmas. Like, I can't believe it's whatever. But truly this month has gone by so quick it is noon on sunday i am in mckinney my hometown i'm actually in downtown mckinney which is really cute packed a bag and i think i'm gonna stay here tonight i'm trying to parallel park honestly i fully credit my ability to parallel park due to growing up on the square so anyways um i am going to get brunch I'm trying to move my bags oh my gosh i'm so hungry also it's like only 60 degrees out right now so it's a wild time How are you? Back up. of course always striking it back up that's what the holiday seasons are for this does not remind you of gilmore girls right now morning i got back from mckinney this morning i really just went and honestly yesterday i just basically slept and chilled sorry i missed a day of uploading honestly i just like needed it and i didn't really have anything to vlog it's just getting harder and harder to do vlogmas when there's just nothing to vlog i'm with the pups i think we might go on a little walk Hopefully I'm gonna do some fun Christmassy things today. I want to download Matthew McConaughey's audiobook because I need to listen to the audiobook. Yes, I have the physical book, but like I need to listen to the audiobook and it take fits on a little walk. So I think that's what we're gonna do. I've talked about this in pretty much every vlog. I've just been feeling so off. So this morning my mom has this whole like crazy organic whole, you know, whatever, mom organic routine and I did it feeling better. So I actually just Instacarted some groceries so I can make a healthier version of bolognese, which I'm actually really excited for, and then smoothies and celery juice and things like that. I just need to get back on my health routine. When I get off of that, I find is when like everything else in my life goes off. Gonna go on a little walk, I think, with Fitz. Hopefully the food will arrive at some point. So there's going to be a full den transformation. This is my comforter that I have yet to bring upstairs. I'm only keeping the um, couch and then the dresser, because Dom's, Dom, honestly, most of this stuff is Dom's too, but, I'm only keeping that stuff for when people come to visit in general. 
my project the week that I'm off after vlogmas is my gym so I'm getting another one of these I don't know I'm just gonna make this a really great workout space that's kind of gonna be the focus of the room now because I feel like I keep changing it around while I would love a movie den realistically I'm gonna use a gym so much more so I need to get rid of a bunch of stuff. That's all trash. We're reorganizing this whole closet tomorrow. I don't know. If you guys have any tips for the room, please let me know. Also, this is my main problem right now. Like, where do I do? Because this is here. And I feel like I need mirrors. So I feel like this wall is going to have to be the mirrors. But I also want to get a TV. So would it look weird if I got mirrors all across this wall until about right here? And then I put the TV there and then it had a mount that just swiveled out so you could watch it in the morning would that be weird i don't know you guys let me know what you think but i'm gonna actually clear out some space before i even go on this walk in this room because tomorrow is the day that we organize out of the way I also got rid of a lot of trash um not trash well I guess boxes of trash yeah so I did and then yeah that will all be organized tomorrow I have all these boxes that just came in that I'm excited for that will go for all the organization tomorrow is like an extreme home organization day um and this is what this looks like right now so great all right my groceries just arrived I've changed I'm actually about to head out the door but this is what I got just to get kind of back on a little bit of like a health grind for the next two days. I mean, it's the holidays at the same time, but just a few things that I know will just make me feel better. Okay guys, I just got dressed. I'm treating myself to a little mulch afternoon. I just need to get out of the house. I think sometimes when you're in a little bit of a funk, like you literally just have to leave. You have to just get out. Taking myself on a little matcha day, I'm going to weekend coffee, which is at the Jewel Hotel. If you guys live in Dallas, you need to go. It's really cute. Um, I also like their matcha. I might get ice today, so I'll let you know if I like it. <laughs> Festive over here. I wanted to just walk in Neiman's, not really to buy anything. It's so weird. I feel like every holiday season, I feel so festive from like November 1st to December 20th. And then when it hits like real time Christmas for some reason, it just doesn't feel like Christmas anymore. And the fact that it's randomly like 65 degrees here uh, when it's been like 30, just kind of throwing me off, you know? And then I need to go to Target because I have to get baskets. Um, because Danielle from the Sorted Place is coming over. I've already mentioned this, but um, she's coming over and she is a professional organizer and we are finishing my house project. And so tomorrow's vlog, honestly, tomorrow's vlog might just be the best one of Vlogmas because it is going to be so satisfying. The last thing I need to pick up for that project though um, are some storage boxes. So happy hour so I need to go back to this building. Hello. That's me when I drive actually. Over here is Queso Beso up there is Sky Blossom. Sky Blossom has legit the absolute worst service ever and they're so rude but honestly the rooftop is so great that you just kind of have to Target. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm thinking I'm gonna right go with there. this shade. <laughs> I like these baskets. Oh, here we go. I think these are actually really nice and I like the look of them. So, oh, great. 10% off too. 
All right, this is what I'm grabbing. I think this will be great for my office closet. Feeling a little anxious, so I'm actually going to go work out. I'm wearing one of my favorite set active sets. I These sports bras are so cute to me. <sighs> All right, guys, I just finished 12 through 30. If you guys don't know what 12 through 30 is, I got it from Lauren Dorado, and it's actually like recently gone viral on TikTok, so I feel like even more people are doing it than she already had from YouTube. It is a treadmill routine, so you do incline of 12, speed of three for 30 minutes. I've been doing it for a few months. I don't do it every day. I just do it probably at least like four days a week. Also, like my insulation on my garage. Well, I guess it doesn't look that bad from where you guys are seeing it, but it's, it's not the best. It is harder than it seems, but it's something that I really love sticking to. I feel like sometimes coming to the gym is overwhelming and just knowing you're going to do this and that's your workout is great. I've been like insane about my fitness routine, so I've really only been doing this. And honestly, I feel really good after. I think I might change it to like 12, 4, 30 soon. Just because I feel like I can do this and I'm fine. But when I first started, I was like, okay, I'm going to die. I much prefer this treadmill routine over running. But update, guys. I feel so much better since I worked out. I was watching vlogs. And I just feel so much better. So this is great. Oh, my gosh. Coco's sneezing. She's so freaking cute. Also, when I get my actual gym set up and we have Kinsey's gym, I don't know if I really told you guys much about this, but I'm checking out my garage as a gym nothing revolutionary but what's gonna be fun is that it's gonna be like my gym that I force my friends to come over and work out with in the morning so really it's just gonna be my cousin for right now um and then like long term we're hoping to acquire a group you know I was just watching Alicia and Remy's vlogs but fit, or Coco has been sitting on the top of these two chairs like the very 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 top right there just watching me and then Fitz was just laying here watching out with my besties Coco literally as soon as I turned the camera on Coco just moved off of me, so. Coco, are you gonna come back or no? Fitzy, hi. Hi. I saw some comments recently that I favor Fitz, and um, while it is <laughs> literally the dumbest thing I think I've ever heard having to like defend my favoritism for my dogs, I just wanna clear the air. Um, I don't have favorites, and I spend just as much time with Coco as I do with Fitz. It's like literally always at my side. Like, example, exhibit A, right here. But Fitz, Fitz can be more cuddly, so I think that's why. Um, but just know, I don't favor them. I spend just as much time with both of them. Honestly, probably more time with Coco, because Fitz has to do his own thing sometimes. So. Love. Well, I hope I make friends in 2021, so it's not just me and the dogs, but we'll see. Hi, 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 love you, love you. Oh, making a healthier version of spaghetti squash. I could even have made the Parmesan healthier, but I don't really care to do that. This is a screenshot from the, my, this is a screenshot that my mom sent me. It's spaghetti squash bolognese. It's from thyroid healing. So that's exciting, everyone. This is everything that you need. There will be a reel on my Instagram if you guys really want the recipe. I'll kind of take you guys through it. But again, I feel like it's so much easier to look back at reels. So I'm actually really excited. I have made a few recipes, I cannot say it, with spaghetti squash that I've loved. So I'm excited for this. today's vlog i hope you enjoyed be sure to check out curology again in the description down below love you guys so much and i will talk to you tomorrow